Now talking about strange things happening during escrow, we have a handout of 88 things that can go wrong in a transaction. And in fact, we added an extra page of another 90 or so things that started to go wrong or could go wrong during the um, re recession and all the short sales that went on, foreclosures, unfortunately. Lots of things come up that we as professionals have dealt with before. And so we at least have an idea how to fix the ones that can be fixed and we have access to other experts that we deal with, whether they're at title, escrow, at the different lenders we use, to try to have access to the answers so that we can know that something that comes up during your transaction, is it something that's fixable with some time or is it something that is a hurdle that just cannot be surmounted? For example, during COVID, when people were being sent home and a verification would go out for employment, is this person working? And the answer was no. When there's not income, like that's when a person doesn't qualify for a loan anymore. But of those 180, all these different uh, examples of things that can go wrong during your escrow, most of them are fixable. Most of them we've seen. Most of them we know how to fix. And hopefully the real estate agent that you choose does too and can get you through that escrow in a relatively smooth way. If you have more questions about that, feel free to call, text, or email me. You'll find my information down below.